Hello, everybody. Good afternoon. How are you all doing today? Sorry, we are running a uh, running a little bit behind today. I uh, unfortunately, uh, my allergies uh, last night. Uh, started to kick in really bad, like, uh, crazy bad, uh, and, uh, it made it really hard to sleep last night and to fall asleep, uh, which is unfortunate. Uh, it's, it's like high pollen season around here, so there's not a whole lot I can do about it. Uh, and then this morning it was not much better. So I, th I think I'm either ha just have really bad allergies or it's maybe, like, evolved into a slight sinus, like, infection going on. But uh, I am here and excited to be here uh, and looking forward to playing this game called Poi, uh, which I know pretty much nothing about. Uh, I know it's a 3D platformer, which, uh, as we all know, I love. Uh, and that's it. I know nothing else about it. But I'm excited about it because I've heard really good things. So with that... Let's hop over into it. All right. Let me make sure. It looks like the audio is looks like the audio is coming through good. So I think we should be good to go. Uh, but yeah. Please forgive me if I found kind of... Uh, please forgive me if I sound a little uh, congested. Once upon a time, there were two orphans. They dreamed of finding adventure in life. So one day, they ran away and set forth on a grand journey. Hey. Hey. Wake up! Mm. Hello there, sorry to wake you up, but I'm in a bit of a pickle. I've lost something very important to me in this forest, and I was wondering if you could help me out. Take a look up there. See that shiny thing up in the tree? That's the very important item I was telling you about. I'm not quite the young sprout I used to be, so could you please climb up there and grab it for me? Now then, which one of you will help me? Yeah! <laughs> you will? Splendid! You've made this old man quite happy. Kehu. I'll wait for you to grab it then. Good luck. Oh, that's cool. You can change characters whenever. Well, we have some crazy hops. Yeah, that's a that's a huge hop. We can double jump. Okay. Now I I read that this game is a collectathon. I, I saw it described as such. I have no idea if collecting all of these matters, like if this is like collecting gems in Spyro. Until proven otherwise, uh, I'm going to do that. Just in case these matter and I do need to be collecting them. So far, the movement feels pretty good. Yes. Uh. 
Medallion collected. A helping hand. Hehu, you got it. Could you possibly do me one more favor? That is a whale. Please bring my important item over to my airship. Be careful climbing down. Oh, does this have fall damage? Hey! Hi there, are you training to become an explorer? Oh, you're just helping an old man. I see, hee <laughs> hee. That flag represents a checkpoint. If you lose all your health, you'll restart here. Okay, so there's health in this game. Oh, oh, you're quite nimble. I can't thank you enough for collecting my Explorer Medallion. <laughs> Hello, Striker! Good afternoon. Good to see you. How are you doing? One more favor. Literally, most games are just doing are just you doing favors. Oh, I know. Genshin Impact, in particular, I think is like the worst offender in that. <laughs> of like, hey, uh, I know you're on a very important quest and have huge things to do, but could you like help me collect uh, like three berries? What's an explorer medallion, you ask? Uh, it's a medallion for explorers. Well, it's a bit of a story. A long time ago, my wife and I traveled the world together, collecting explorer medallions wherever we went. Our biggest adventure was a journey to find a mystical treasure called the Milky Way Globe. One day, however, we got caught in a very bad storm. We tried to hang on, but I hit my head and everything went dark. <laughs> when I woke up, my wife was missing and all of our explorer medallions were gone. Oh, he looks so dejected. I've been slowly trying to find the rest of my Explorer medallions, but it's not very easy for me anymore. No, it's not a story, it's just another collectible MacGuffin. Can you imagine a collectathon style game? Uh, with like all kinds of collectibles and mini games and stuff, but the main character, uh, is like third wall breaking the entire time, or fourth wall breaking the entire time, and's like had enough of it. But they're like doing it because they're like a, you know. They're the they're a playable uh, main character in a video game, and so like someone's like, I need you to go collect this for me, and they're like, Ugh, whatever. It's just another MacGuffin, isn't it? Like that would be so funny. Like it's just incredibly witty, sarcastic. Maybe there's already a game like that, but that sounds really fun. I would totally play that. Say, why don't you help me find them? It will be quite an adventure. Will you be paying me? Mm -hmm. Will you help an old man out? <laughs> Wife became a Pokemon in the next Mystery Dungeon. Oh, no. Will you help an old man out? I loved an adventure. Uh, no, I guess I'd love an adventure. Awesome! Hey, who? That's the spirit. Let's get going, then. Hang on. Uh, this old man's hehu kind of reminds me of Mario's Yahoo. So, oh, I can't help but imagine him as like an old man Mario. I always pick no and either the game ends or I basically get told I have no choice. I love games where you can choose to like just say no to whatever the plot is is doing and then it just like ends it's so funny when they do that mm -hmm. 
surprised at how high we are? Hehu. Welcome to the sky. <laughs> Welcome to the sky. It's uh, basically endless and there's nothing here. From here, we can fly anywhere in the world of Poi. Take a look over there. That's our first stop, Cozy Canyon. I was on my way to look for more Explorer medals, medallions before I noticed the one in that forest. They're incredibly radioactive, that's why you can see them from anywhere. Since you're an official explorer in training now, why don't you take us over there? See the steering wheel in the middle of the ship? Oh, you're just gonna have me fly this? You, like, just hired this kid. Push the bars to turn us towards that silhouette. Pay no attention to the compass, it's a little broken right now. Hey, who? Oh, that's not good. Got all that? Don't worry, I know you'll figure it out. Now take us to Cozy Canyon. Alright. Cozy Canyon, activate the windmill. Oh, this is very, uh... Like Mario... Like, 64, isn't it? <laughs> wow, I love Mario Galaxy 2. <laughs> yeah, this, this is giving off a lot of, like... 3D Mario vibes. This way to Cozy Canyon. Okay. Well, we're not going back that way. What on earth are these things? Oh, I don't like that it made a noise. Hey, can you... How do I hurt things? I try to stay on the path to avoid running into enemies. You see, I'm not strong enough to jump on them. Tweedledee. Oh, I have Okay, I'm going to assume that this is going to be kind of... Mario-esque, and that there's probably going to be a collection. <laughs> there's probably going to be a, a thing where I need to collect all the coins, and uh, I'll just do that later. How can I hurt things? Plumb the Hermit Crab 2023. Yeah. <laughs> How can I hurt my enemies? Oh, that was kind of rough. New location. Windy Windmill. Well, it's not turning, so that's a problem. It looks like this windmill could use a little power. Where does that strange yellow wire lead? Oh. This windmill is hand cranked, of course. Ooh. What? Why didn't I think of that? Medallion collected. Activate the windmill. That was pretty pretty easy, pretty straightforward. Welcome back, explorer. I have something to show you. Come here and take a look. Is it the sky again? While you were gone, I happened to dig up some of my old explorer tools. Some tools will help you navigate levels. Others will help will give you more ways to explore. Of course, you'll need to give me some coins before I give them to you. Even a master explorer such as myself needs to eat. Hey, who? But you're not paying me. Take a look. See things far away. Make it easier to navigate levels. Coins. Dig up fossils. But we'll get the shovel, because I already found something that needed it. Use the shovel to dig for treasure and fossils. Try digging in a lot of places. You won't be able to dig on hard surfaces, however. Okay. I use the triggers to select and press Y to use it. He did say levels. Just talk to me again if you'd like to buy an explorer tool. Well then, get going. But 
the Flower Festival. Today is the Flower Festival. You should go and join the festivities. This game is, uh, very, you know, I said Mario 64 earlier, but this is very, like, Mario, like, sunshine. Come on, old man, at least pretend to not be aware of linear game design. <laughs> he can't help it. He, he can see beyond. Oh, wait a minute. Didn't I just pass the thing? Yes, I did. Okay. You found a dig site. How are you doing that? Are you talking into my mind? Equip your shovel and dig. You'll probably find some rare treasures, so keep an eye out for other dig sites. Fossil found. Trilobite. You found a fossil. Hehu. Let's record each fossil you find in your explorer book. I've heard that there is an archaeologist in Mount Magma who is looking for them. You might want to find him. Maybe he can help us find explorer medallions. I did not like that death note. Or that death noise. Yeah, the death noise they make is a little concerning. When they... They make a weird noise when they see you, too. Yeah, everything seems a little too sentient for me. Please help me- please help find my seed. I think I lost it in a nearby cave. Please help me find my seed. I think I lost it in a nearby cave. Did they all? Oh. They all... They all lost them in a nearby cave? Oh, this level's kind of large. I see a shop over there. Oh, that looks kind of cave-like. This year's contest will begin once all three contestants are ready. Uh, I have no idea what to do with this fox. Fossil found. Big footprint. Thanks for finding my seed. I knew it was in that cave after all. Oh, for some reason I thought I was going to have to carry those. But I guess I just need a... I guess I just need to, uh, get near them. I'm not sure how I ended up here. I'm scared of heights. Please be careful and avoid standing too close to the narrow cliffs. Tweedledee. Did that heart just make a stock cartoon noise when you picked it up? Uh, no. <laughs> Thanks for finding my seed. I knew it was in that cave after all. Okay, that's two of them. Oh, the other one must be down there. Oh, I can do a dive. Thanks for finding my seed. Did they yell that to me over there? I think so. I don't know how they did it. I also don't know how the old man was talking to me earlier. Oh, a chest. Yeah, the old man was talking to me somehow earlier too, like into my mind, directly. 
It's time. Let the contest begin. And it looks like this year's winner is Yellow. We hope to see you again next year. Enjoy the rest of the festival, everyone. Oh, there's the awesome. Medallion collected. Oh, it's like evening now. Welcome back, Esplorer. We seem to have a visitor off our port side. Take a look. That looks like a pirate. I wonder if they're friendly. You should go find out. They do not look friendly. How will you get over there? Here, use my old Explorer sail. They, they don't look friendly. They're, they're, way, they're flying the black flag <laughs> with the skull and crossbones. Has it ever failed to activate? Not yet. <laughs> Go on now, jump off the ship. Uh, okay. Whoa. Uh... How do I go up? Uh... I appear to be... gliding, but not flying. Um... Are there wind currents that will pick me up? I don't know how I'm supposed Yahoo! to get up there. Woo! Oh, that is weird. If you pull down on the stick, you go up. I was was not expecting that. Hey. Oh, that was kind of a deep voice. Ahoy there, you must be one of those explorer folk. I'm a traveling merchant. In exchange for coins, you can borrow my cannon to visit far-off lands. This guy does not look like a merchant. <laughs> I guess I'll just buy all of these. Oh, I don't have enough coins. I think I would have hit- it looked like I hit the mast of that ship there. Up. Climb to the top. Find the hidden ladders to make your way up. 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 Alright, seems straightforward enough. Up. There's a ladder somewhere on this. Oh, there's a ladder over there. Oh, I knew it. Okay, there's a ladder over there. That was not too challenging, but that's okay. Medallion collected puzzle tower. Hey.
Oh, that's funny. It started the sound effect again. Huh. Alright, down we go. Oh, I did like a really weird hop off of that. Hop. If this level was in Mario Sunshine, there'd be no ladders and you'd have to risk spin jumping to get to the top. And given how slippery that Mario is, it'd be really frustrating. Oh. That just makes me think of the, the infamous Pachinko level. I have played through Mario Sunshine fully once. Uh, and I remember that level being really hard. Yes! Hey. Sky Grid. Okay, maybe this one will be a little harder. Yeah, that slide was uh, also not too not too uh, hard. What is this? Let's see. Be careful not to fall. It's a long way down. Such super very slide. Alright, that one was a little easier. <laughs> Welcome back, Explorer. Huh, did you hear something just now? It sounded like it came from the top of the airship. Go investigate. How? Oh, right, I guess I can just... I guess I can just jump off. I can do the most logical thing if you wanted to climb up to the top of an airship, which is jump off of the ship to begin with. Oh, it's this person. Ah, oh, darn it. You found me. I hope I hopped aboard your airship before you left the forest. I want to go on an adventure, too. Anyways. Wait, did I go into the forest? I guess the forest was the starting area. Anyway, since we're adventuring together, now I suppose I could give you tips and tricks. Um. I don't really think I need them right now. I agree, these levels are pretty short. Hey. Okay, let's try the climbing course. Ah! Alright, maybe this one could be a little harder. I cannot, I cannot punch the other side, like Mario style. I think I can just get on top of this. Oh. I bet I can get on top. If I try. I knew it. I wonder if I can get on top of that. I'm gonna try. Now it's too far. Well, I missed a cycle, so I guess I'm gonna stand here.
Uh, I would like to let go. Well, every time I tried to let go, I just grabbed on again. There we go. Awesome. Okay, I don't. That was pretty hard to let go of while it was moving and like towards me. Oh my gosh, that one actually felt like a level. Yeah, that one was a little. That one was a little more challenging. Hey. Wake run. Oh, I'm five coins short. Okay, back to Cozy Canyon. It's it's been a second since we were here. Rocket blast off. Okay. Oh, I almost forgot. Take my old explorer book. I forgot to give it to you on the airship. Oh, okay. It's like telling me everything. Okay, places. This is places to visit. Fossils. Medallions. And collectibles. Okay. Okay. Okay, there's the rocket. Lighthouse Cove. Oh, it really felt like there would have been something up here. Oh, I can't. There's definitely going to be something up here later. Oh, may as well see what this merchant has. Welcome. Oh, you might be wondering who I am. Well, I run a small business here selling goods. If you bring me 100 coins, I'll sell you something really nice. Can't tell you what. It would ruin the surprise. Those propellers hurt you if you touch them. Yep, they do. It would ruin the surprise. Literally, a sign next to telling you what it is. <laughs> there, young explorer. I seem to be stuck on this small island. I was working on my mission when a part of my spaceship fell off. Now I can't seem to find it. Can you help me find it? Oh no, I probably already passed this. Great. Although I noticed you don't have a compass. I'm sure it would be much easier to find this in part with one, but you seem to be full of energy. I'm sure you can find it. Oh. Wait. Oh, 
Oh, that falls. Uh, I have no idea what this part looks for, or it looks like. And I didn't buy the compass, so I now... I now I'm gonna have to find it by hand. Fractured fin. Well, we're we're going we're going on a hunt. Oh, he's lower. The fractured fin looks like an empanada. Ooh, empanada sounds good. I love empanadas. Can we swim? You know what? We may as well find out. We can swim. I was partially expecting to not be able to swim. I really should have bought that compass. What is this thing? What is this? That's a very weird looking thing. Okay, the part must not be over here. It must be back in the earlier area. Okay, I'm gonna guess the part is over here. I expected not to be able to start playing too much Sonic S games. I know. I was I was like, oh I'm gonna jump in and it's gonna like that's gonna be it. Sonic and like Spyro 1 too. Oh well, there's another dig site. Fossil found. Crusty Asian. It's a crab. Crab collected. Though it's not a hermit crab, so we do deduct points for that. I have no idea how much that compass was, but I'm starting to think I'm going to need to uh, just collect the money and go buy it. Because I don't think I... If, if there are going to be levels in this game where you just have to, like, find stuff. Uh, I don't want to, like, every time have to just run around the entire... Whoops. I don't want to have to run around the entire map every time trying to find it. I just don't know how much it cost. I could go... Underneath this, well, actually, wait, it's a waterfall. There is nothing behind the waterfall. I'm disappointed because he did not find the fossilite remains of his brethren. Look, so few games, so few games give uh, have hermit crabs in them that even if it's just a fossil of a hermit crab. Oh my gosh. That thing took me out. Okay, we're buying this compass. It's a bar, show the direction of characters and secrets. Okay. I'm gonna want that magnet. Actually died, died. I mean, yeah, that thing just took me out. It just yeeted a huge boulder at me, and that was it. Hmm. It shows things over here? 
Uh, oh gosh. I don't know what they are. I think the blue thing is a person. Oh, there's a chest over there. Yeah, we're definitely going to want to get that magnet. What was it, 125, I think? Pointing towards a fossil. It's, well, it's huge. Fossil found stuffed hopper. I don't know if that was a fossil, but okay. There's another fossil this way. Back there. Dusty shell. Hey, if we combine that with the crab from earlier. Uh, okay, I guess we're going this way. Alright, I can't help but wonder if I'm, uh, I'm not gonna see the, the ship piece on my compass until I talk to the guy to be told that there is a ship piece. I have no idea if that's how it's going to work, but I have a I have a sneaking suspicion. Sure. Oh, yep, he attached it to the compass now. Moonfish Rock. I'm a little confused on how that was a moonfish, but okay. To me, that looked kind of like a donut. Not a moonfish, but you know what? The Forbidden Fruit Loop. Cosmos Fragment. Okay. Peace go. Did I? Oh, that's it. You found it. Thanks for helping me out. All right, I guess I'll jump in it. What's the worst that could happen? This appears to be a one-man ship. Sir, are you not joining me? Okay. Am I... Seeing some, like, really weird debug menu? I... I think I'm seeing a weird debug menu. Oh. Studying them... I am definitely seeing, like, a weird debug menu pop up. That's so weird. Why do I see that? I didn't even do anything. Oh. 
That's so weird. Oh, I guess I can just jump on them. Also, we are Mario Galaxy now. Seriously, why am I seeing a debug like screen? I uh, I haven't even pressed any buttons uh, or anything other than just starting it up and using a controller. Oh, the compass points towards keys, of course. Wait, why is it it's showing two keys? I, I really hope that this weird debug thing goes away once I leave. Oh, it went- it did go away. That's so weird. I really want that magnet. Oh, he's over here. Okay. May as well see what's going on. Right of travel book, best locations. Okay. Flew into the propeller of a ship. Okay. Ha! Collect the seven keys. Oh joy, more keys. I was just thinking that, actually. I was like, it just had me collect a bunch of keys. And now it's like, hey, how about more keys? <laughs> what if you collect the six keys and just step on the seventh randomly? Hello, egg! How are you doing today? It's good to see you. Also, that would be pretty funny. Yeah, I was just thinking, uh... Like, it's going straight from find keys to find more keys. I wonder if I pick that up, if it'll end the level. Like, on me. There's a key, okay. I, you can't jump high enough to hit it. Uh, I gotta say, this game so far, nothing against it. Not not hating on it, nothing against it. It is not blowing me away, like I had hoped. So yeah, how am I enjoying it? Uh, it is okay so far. Just from watching, it seems a little generic, not in a bad way. Yeah, it's... the problem is... It hasn't really... How would I, how would I describe it? So far, it doesn't seem to have anything it's excelling at. Oh my gosh, if I get hit by another rock... Okay. 
Uh, so far, it doesn't seem to be excelling at any one thing. Like, it's not particularly cute. Uh, like Little Gator Game was, which was a big appeal in playing it, was because it, it was cute. Uh, it doesn't seem to have much of a story going. It's not very difficult. Um... So far, it has not had anything that's, like, really grabbing about it. I'm gonna keep going for a, and see if it, like, if it gets me. Like, like if I'm just... Because I am playing on the first, like, world, so maybe it's just really easy here. Hide and seek. It zoomed in on this guy. Okay, maybe not. Sure. Hide and seek. I'll run and hide. Your job to find me. If you find me, I'll give you something extra special. Hide out in my own treehouse. It wouldn't put her on the compass, would it? Okay, it did not put her on the compass. Treehouse? But yeah, I'm gonna give the game a little more, uh, a little more time before I like make any big judgments on it. But so far, it has not blown me away. Yeah, it couldn't be one of these medallions, could it? I honestly don't even know what she's talking about. Whoops. I honestly don't even know what she's talking about with the treehouse. Oh. Oh my gosh. Wait. Wow, you found me. That was not hard. As promised, here's your reward. It better not be a medallion. Gosh, darn it. <laughs> it's a medallion. Yes! <laughs> That's a treehouse. That's a chair nailed to the side of a tree. Yeah, that was uh, less treehouse and more uh, like a... Oh gosh, what are they called in hunting? I don't remember what they're called, uh, but it's like wait, wait, when you put up the chair in a tree, the uh, like watch from above when you're hunting. This game, why? That was a little, that was a little rough. I'm going to finish the first world and start the second one. Uh, before I decide. I see the tree, not seeing the house. Look, it's not a tree house, it's a tree home. <laughs> oh, by the way, Ad is going to start in about, uh, five seconds. Can I go take a look at the lighthouse? Sure, why not? Alright, Ad starting soon. In the meanwhile, I'm gonna go check out this lighthouse. I'm going the wrong way. The lighthouse is that way. I was going towards the wind wheel. In no way similar to a lighthouse. Except it's a tall structure, I guess. Ad break. Meanwhile, back at the Hall of Justice. <laughs> Is the lighthouse a tent with the flashlight taped to the top? <laughs> Maybe. Maybe it is. It, it might be just a tent. Is it? <laughs> it would be even funnier if it was a tree. Like, the tree house is just a tree with a little wooden plank. The lighthouse is just a tree with a flashlight on it. Oh, I guess I'm going in. Oh! Is the- are- wow, are we- don't- are we really just gonna do the, uh... The... The blooper fight from, uh, Mario uh, Sunshine? 
Mr. Octo. So this is what was inside the lighthouse all along. Wait, is the sign telling me this? Wait, it is the sign telling me that. Someone... <laughs> someone wrote that on this sign. Am I supposed to kick these at his tentacles? Oh my gosh, this is... I am supposed to kick. Why would you write that on a sign? That, see, that's what I'm wondering. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, please. Oh no. You know what? I'm going in the water. I'm clearly in no danger in here. You know, I blew up those tentacles, and yet he appears to still have eight. Ha! Oh my gosh. Did I, like, miss my opportunity to hurt him? I see tentacles under the water. Okay, so after watching this for a bit, I'm kind of enjoying riffing on it. Yeah, that's like been the best part of this game so far. <laughs> I'm sorry if the developers are watching. Uh, your game's not terrible. It's just kind of funny to. It's just kind of fun to, to poke fun at it. But yes, riffing on it is actually kind of fun. Ow. I'm really wondering what the health is for in this so far, because I am in... I, I really don't think I'm in any danger here. Oh my gosh, it just whiffs over it every time. No, I'm gonna miss it. I don't even think it matters, but... He's too far away for me to hit. Oh my gosh. I mean, can you try to get hurt? Yeah, I don't even know if I could get hurt. I, I think I'd have to throw myself at him. And I'm not that kind of crap. Okay, let's see. No, that was not it. That was it. <laughs> All right. Well, that was that. This lighthouse is huge! Wait, wait a minute, actually. This lighthouse makes no sense. I'm on the inside of the lighthouse, but, like, there's no... Not only is it way bigger on the inside, so it's a TARDIS, but also, uh... <laughs> there's nothing lighthousey inside here, it's just a... An orb filled with water. How do I know that Mr. Octo wasn't running the lighthouse? Mystery of the lighthouse. I don't think I can have more than a hundred coins, by the way. I think I'm gonna have to buy the big wallet to be able to, to buy it with the mag the magnet. Okay, let's go try the last challenge level. I'm putting a lot of hopes into this. I'm really hoping this last challenge is hard. Hey. Okay, it's the Quake Run. On first glance, just looking at that image, it kind of makes me think of the Mario Sunshine, the Sandbird. Ah! Mystery of the Lighthouse, that's literally a Mario Sunshine level name. Is it? Because it kind of sounds like one. Uh, I think these are just going to fall. These are just going to fall. Oh, it, this is kind of challenging looking. We might be onto something. Oh, I was 
was I was wrong. <laughs> <Yes>! <laughs>What did that have to do with Quake? <laughs> There's no way on earth someone beat that level in five and a half seconds. Hey. Is that it? That was it. Okay. Well, all the challenges are done. Yahoo! Up, up. Hello, doggy. I knew there was going to be a, co a coin collect. <laughs> Yahoo! Oh! It's for the raccoon, the merchant. That makes sense. Hello, doggy. Oh, you've been lurking. Oh, okay. <laughs> uh, unless I'm mistaken... Cozy Canyon. Yeah, okay. This is the last medallion of this world. I really hope the magma area is harder. These... The keys... Even though I'm not on the key collect medallion section, like, I didn't pick that as my my objective. They're still taking up, like, uh, like, space on my compass UI. Do these guys drop coins? Yes, they do. Uh, okay, going this way. You know, I was I just realized this song is kind of vaguely like uh, old western sounding, isn't it? There's like a part of this song that just sounds really old west. Like a more whimsical Oregon Trail. Yeah, yeah. It's kind of got that vibe. Guess I'm going up here now. This would have been easier if I had done it the other direction. That's okay. <laughs> the Oregon Oak Trail. <laughs> Hello, Jay! I'm doing well. Uh, my allergies were pretty bad last night and this morning. Uh... I might be fighting a slight sinus infection, but besides that, I am doing well. I would say physically, I have been I have been a little better, but mentally, uh, I am doing fantastic. Uh, we, we are currently uh, riffing on this game because it is uh, decidedly uh, kind of mid. Oh, you know what? I bet this guy will drop coins. One coin. Oh, I'm one coin shy. Okay, 101. Perfect. Hup, ha, hup. <laughs> oh, you've collected 100 coins. Would you like to buy my mystery item? Is it a medallion? Thank you. Your item will be right over here. It's a medallion. <laughs> Cozy Canyon Mastery. I have collected all Explorer medallions in the Cozy Canyon. Oh gosh, the mystery item couldn't possibly be a medallion. <laughs> God dang it. It was a mist. It was a medallion. Oh. It didn't end the level. That's really weird. Okay, we're just going to leave.
Okay, let's check just to be sure. Make sure there's not some crazy mystery. Okay, nope. Where else can we go? Let's see. Unknown, which takes 40 medallions. How many do I have? 13. The Cozy Canyon. Is this the volcano? That actually did not reveal it anymore. <laughs> okay, Mount Magma. I can keep turning it, actually. What is this? An unknown mystery zone. Which I almost have unlocked already. Alright, we're going to Mount Magma, everybody. Smoke at the Stone Tower. That was a noise. Aru, a new visitor to Mount Magma. Oops. I hope you're not mean like those bucket heads. Okay, I do like these. These things are kind of cute. That noise they make is very unusual, though. Uh, smoke. This is called Smoke at the Tower, right? Okay, I just need to get to that. guy. Uh -huh. <laughs> oh, hello there. You look like you're on quite an adventure. I see you have a shovel, too. Are you by chance collecting fossils? M maybe. I'm an archaeologist who is traveling the world in search of rare and unique fossils. Maybe you can help me out. If you happen to dig up any fossils, I'd love to take them for my special project. Tell you what, if you happen to find me in the sky, I'll tell you all about it. See you around. Oh, I have some... Uh -huh. Oh, okay, I guess I can't give them to him here. Alright, fair, fair enough. Does this count as a fa- oh, it does. He's not an archaeologist. <laughs> He's just homeless. Mysterious Tooth. That mysterious tooth could belong to our mystery man. He claims to be an archaeologist, and yet... There was a, a fossil not ten meters away from him. Oh. I now have a hat. Will they treat me as one of their own now? Nope, I guess not. They can see right through me. Be careful, Aru. These There could be falling rocks ahead. Wow. Okay. Aru, the stone tower's flame has gone out. Mount Magma will not be happy. It will destroy our homes. Please help us before it's too late. Uh, okay. Thank you. I will open the gate. Be careful. It's dark and scary inside. This thing can't be bigger than 20 by 20 feet. How could it possibly be? It is bigger on the inside. Oh. Okay, this seems like a perfect place for lava to start rising up. This would be a perfect place for lava to start rising and for the platforms to start uh, receding inwards on a time limit. That is not what happened. Hey, what's this punk doing up here? They can talk? 
trying to help out those dopey Lavasaurus Rex. Uh, wait, I'm wearing a bucket. Not on our watch. Oh, I wanted to do it in one. Aw, I was really hoping I was going to get a second bucket to put on top of my other bucket. Aru, you did it. You saved our homes. You take this, but be careful. It looks scary. Could it be a medallion? My goodness. It's a medallion. How is that scary? It's just like... You know what? It's fine. Yes! <laughs> yeah, I don't know how that was scary. These, these, they're like Tyrannosaurus with wings and horns, and they live on a volcano, but the medallion is scary. All man, man with a beard came by while you were gone. How on earth did that get there? A hat? What is that? Oh, I lost my bucket. No, my bucket! It was my friend. Alright, well, I guess we'll go talk to, uh... This guy. Hey there, we meet again. Welcome to Fossil Island. As I mentioned in Mount Magma, I've been traveling the world in search of rare fossils. My dream is to build the best fossil museum in the world, and you can help me out. As you collect fossils, I'll display them here for you. There's only one exhibit, but as you visit more worlds, I'll create more. Don't worry, the fossils still belong to you. I'll just take care of them. And make a profit off of the, uh, the entry fees. What will you get in return? Hmm. I found some shiny things. I can give you those for helping me complete each exhibit. Okay. I found all the fossils in Cozy Canyon. Here's my reward. Is it a medallion? It's a medallion. <laughs> okay, it will always be a medallion. <laughs> it doesn't matter what they do or say. It's always going to be a medallion. <laughs> Finally, a worthy opponent. Our battle will be legendary. Alright, well... Alright, I gotta know what this moonfish rock was. Archaeologist? <laughs> That's amazing. A strange rock that is theorized to be created by moonfish. The purpose is unknown. What are you talking about? Alright. Do I have enough to unlock the other area? Oh, this is the wrong place. Wait, who's on this ship? There's like two more ships here. Ahoy, kiddo. My airship blew a gasket and I've lost all my golden gears. At this rate, it will take forever to make all the repairs. If you happen to find golden gears, bring me them. I'll give you something good in return. Could it be a medallion? Hey, do you want to go back to the forest? Uh, I guess. Trees and keys. This is interesting, because this is the starting zone. It's keys. Oh, there's a gear. <laughs> oh, hey, we can go behind this waterfall. That's oh, the enemy saw me from down there. That's weird. That snake's an enemy or an NPC? It's an enemy. <laughs> I 
I want the girl from How to Train Your Dragon. We have that girl from How to Train Your Dragon at home. You're not supposed to be here. Did you see that red star up in the sky? If you look at it using a special item, something good will happen. What the heck are you talking about? That? Oh, is it the, uh... Is it like the fly cap from Mario 64? The wing cap? Oh. I did not expect to... What the heck? The bats can shoot at me. What the heck? I'm rich. Oh. They can hit you from underneath. Oh my gosh. I'm on my last health. Not looking good here. Medallion? Oh my gosh, they're gonna throw so many rocks at me. Awesome. Medallion collected, hiding in a hole. Ha ha ho ha ha. Yeah, <laughs> pretty much. Do I have enough? No, 16. Oh my gosh. Wait, I guess I'll buy the. By the telescope. Why not? Can't yeah, buy anything else. Okay. Back to the forest. That's so weird that for the forest, I can't use the, uh, I can't use my ship to fly back here. But for some reason, I have to, uh, I have to use an alternate route to get back. Why can't I just fly back? It's just such a strange design decision. Oh, but the ship is right there! showing up on my... Hey, another golden gear. It's not showing up on my compass. What on earth? What does that mean? No, that's for the medallion. Is it over here? Oh, it's over here. <laughs> Thank you for putting the medallion back at the start of the level game. Seemingly only to make me have to backtrack. Medallion collected. Hello there, uh, hello. You've been doing a good job collecting fossils. I've just opened up a second, a special area on Fossil Island. Come take a look. I don't think I will. Up. 
Back to the forest. Oh, okay. I was gonna do the red star next, but I guess that's the next thing to do anyways. Oh, right, it's back. Back here. That was it. Oh, um, I'm actually... I'm not gonna lie. I'm a little disappointed by that one in particular. Of everything so far, that one... That one kind of stung. I, I was really hoping we were gonna go to, like, an alternate level. That's not a level. Yeah, I know. I was really hoping. Red? Okay. There's now a ring. <laughs> what does it mean? Oh my gosh, it's like foggy now. What does it say? Fly through the ring to enter the super soaring course. Okay. I have high hopes for this course. Hello there, and welcome to the Super Soaring Course. He didn't say Aru. I run a little soaring contest up here for the locals, although none of them are very good at flying. Oh, there it is. Aru. How about you? Would you like to give it a shot? I'll have to pay? Yeah, who lives up here? We're up in the sky. Then again, everybody seems to be up here. Oh, good, good thing there's coins here. I can make back my money. Oh, I might miss one. I'm gonna miss one. It was the coin. No way. This thing does not turn very well at all. Alright. Note to self, do not go for the coins. Well, except for the ones that are directly in front of me, I guess. That was a huge detour, and I actually don't think it's going to stop me at all. It did not stop me at all. It's a medallion! Yes! Now that was just the easy course. Huh. Oh good, I can just hop into it. Okay, I gotta go see if there's something on top of this. This just screams something is here. There is nothing here. Oh, there, there's a gear, though, right behind me. Alright, we'll try the normal course. Okay, this one looks m interesting.
You know what? That was... That was harder than the last one. It was more difficult, so you know what? It's it did not wrong. Welcome back. I've spotted more Explore Medallions in a new world. Oh, it's the one from earlier. What was it? Sinking Sands. It's filled with dangerous quicksand. But I'm sure you can handle it. Uh, I gotta go try the hard course. Yeah, let's go see the hard course. I have high hopes for the hard course. Wow, 25 coins to try it. Oh, this time it has rotating platforms. Okay, this is going to be interesting. Okay, maybe not. That was a little harder than the last one, so I guess it was the harder course. Yeah, this next part looks challenging. Awesome. Gets it immediately with no, no problems. Okay, I guess I'll go see some tomorrow. Digging is hard work. What the heck is this? What, what is this? Welcome to Fossil Island's newest attraction, the Fossil Hunter Academy. If you want to be a true fossil hunter, you can prove your skills here. Each rank gets you something shiny. Oh my gosh. Okay. Oh, okay. Am I... Bomb near? More mini-games, yes. Just what we needed, mini-games. I don't know if I actually needed to pick that up. That was kind of like Minesweeper, but like also <laughs> not Minesweeper. Okay, what do these these guys have to say over here? Do they have anything relevant? Have I tried playing? Oh. Oh my gosh, really? The physicians never change. It's not randomized. What did the other guy have to say? Okay. He's just talking about relaxing. Nothing too crazy. Okay. It's 
they see something relevant. Okay, don't peek. All right, we'll start in the corner. <laughs> okay. Uh -huh. Wow. Thank you for that. Well, we know not to dig in the bottom right corner again. Bomb near. Okay, what about up here? Bomb near. Okay. Here? Fossil near. Okay. Fossil near. Alright, we're done. Okay, gonna throw out a... Gonna throw out a guess. Gonna guess the last one is a 5x5 five five grid. Up, up, up. Could be wrong. Uh -huh. Oh my goodness, I was correct. Up. Start here. Bomb near. Okay, what about here? How about up here? Bomb near, okay. Bomb near, okay. Fossil near. What about here? Bomb near, okay, nope. Bomb near. Here? Oh boy, I don't remember. Fossil near. All right, done. <laughs> All right, well, that series of mini games is done. Hey, kid. I've unlocked a few more challenges. Oh, my gosh. They're more difficult than the last ones. Say no more. Wait, where is he? Wait, where where is he? Over here. Okay. Hey. Lava pit dash. You know what? We'll start with the lava pit dash. Why not? Then we'll do the old tightrope tango. Oh, this one actually looks like it could be hard. I've got high hopes for this one. If you catch on fire, stay calm and try to remain on the platform until you're extinguished. Okay. Seems straightforward. Lava pit dash is done. Again, someone did it in six seconds. I don't know how they did that. Hey. How much do I need? 175. Okay. Well, that's not happening right now. Whoa. I guess we're going back to the forest. Coins amongst the leaves. I'm gonna guess that this is the collect all 100 coins uh, section.
I have no idea what these do. Those green gems that say plus five. I don't know what those do. They don't give me health. And they don't give me money. They carefully worded that, knowing the internet of today. <laughs> um, do you know how many crab coins I have? I do not. How many crab coins do you have? I'm gonna guess it's a lot. Over 17,000. Oh my gosh. That's a lot of crab coins. I'm sorry, I need better redeems. I need better uses for the crab coins. <laughs> I'm saving them. <laughs> That's scary. <laughs> Please, you're gonna crash the crab economy. <laughs> you're gonna <laughs> you're gonna destroy the crab economy, doggy. It can't handle that <laughs> it can't handle that much currency being released at once. <laughs> I collected all the coins over here. Make a points dono. I need to do something with them. Okay, while we're just running around mindlessly collecting coins, here's something uh, that I've, I've been playing a lot off off stream recently. <laughs> when 10% of plum viewers hold 80% of all the crab wealth. <laughs> Big hmm. Uh, I've been playing a, a, like super recently, uh, like in the last week, I started playing super auto pets. Don't know if anyone here has played it. Uh, it's a free-to-play auto battler that is asynchronous multiplayer. Uh, I got into it. It is very, very fun. Uh, it's on Android, iOS, and Steam. Uh, very, very enjoyable game. Uh, I'm kind of hooked on it. Uh, I got Raptor very hooked on it. Uh, a couple of my friends are, like, really into it, and I got my uh, sister-in-law uh, hooked on it now. It's, it's really fun. You've collected 100 coins. Would you like to buy my mystery item? Listen, you don't gotta lie to me. You don't gotta call it a mystery item. That insults, that insults us both. Just call it a medallion. At least he had the decency to put it right next to me. <laughs> he didn't put it on the other side of the map. Oh, I hit continue. I should have hit to sky. I didn't see the option until it was too late. Let's go back to the forest. Never mind. There's no point. Well, or is there? I collected all the gears. There are no fossils there. Hmm. There's two places I haven't been in Cozy Canyon. And there's also gears there now. I guess we're going to go back to Cozy Canyon. No, I don't want to go to Mount Magma. Oh, good. Back to Cozy Canyon. Uh, I guess we'll just set it on the coin collecting one. Okay. There are two places I have not been here. And there are five 
gears. I need to go to the Golden Buoy and to Flappy Bird. Not to be confused with uh, the mobile game. <laughs> to Flappy what? Okay, something of note to bring up here. Um, my compass is supposed to point me towards collectibles, goodies, and things of interest. It does not, however, point towards the golden gears. that there's not a golden gear up there. I guess I can look. Uh, okay, no. Oh, let me guess. Is Flappy Bird the bird? Do I have to, like... Oh my gosh, that hit me out of the sky. How am I supposed to hit this guy? There we go. I think I have to, like... I think I have to just, like, hit the bird. That is gonna be really hard. Okay. This matters, like... Okay. Yeah, I have no idea if it matters to, like, visit all the locations. I'm hoping it gives me something. Because it would be kind of silly to, like... Make it, a th like, a thing to check off on the checklist and then not reward me. We're gonna find out. I need to find these golden gears still, too. How many am I missing? I'm missing three. I'm giving the game too much credit. I'm gonna guess... Uh... Wild guess. It's gonna give me a medallion. There's one up here. Whoa, I did not want to do that. Oh, there's the golden buoy. Okay. We need to find three coins. Or gears. There's one on that. There's one on the line. Oh gosh, I don't think I can... I don't think I can see any other ones from up here. That's not good. Oh, I'm falling. We're falling. I have no idea where that's going to be. Uh, I guess we're just going to go grab the one that's over here. We're going to miss. 
Okay. Do we get anything? Get to the golden buoy. It would appear no. Do I get anything? Does anything happen if I look up at the ship? No, okay. Really, what, what if I look up at that? No. No, okay. It's a buoy. I still don't know what, what on earth that thing is. Okay. We're still missing two of the gears. Oh, I bet there's one on the moon. There's definitely gonna be a gear on the moon. Oh, there's one. Okay. That makes four. Weird. The the way that it just placed that on the the screen makes it seem like it's gonna be back that way. Down here. Oh, it's right there. I was right. It was going to be further back. Okay. I think that should be everything. We got all the medallions. We got all the gears. We collect. We've been everywhere. We got all of the fossils. Okay. Well, we're done visiting that area. Um, you know what? We can do another challenge. Hey, the tightrope tango. This one could be difficult. These little propellers are actually pretty hard to jump over. Yep. <laughs> Whoops. Oh, that's interesting. Falling doesn't cost life. I did fall a couple times. Welcome back. I found some of my old explorer clothes today. You can try them on below deck. I also had some other costumes. It looks like I lost those too. Hidden somewhere. Oh my goodness. This game just never it never ends with the collect the collectibles. have the Master Explorer costume. Ha! 
<laughs> That's why we have to judge a level positively if you die more. Let me guess. Oh. There we go. Uh, we'll just put it back on collect 100 coins. Is there an outfit hidden on this level somewhere? Is it on the... Huh? No, it's not on the compass, of course not. Please, game, if you're gonna give me a compass, let it point towards things. I'm gonna guess that... There has to be an outfit on each level, right? I mean... It would make no sense if there was not an outfit on each level. In fact, I think that's kind of what the guy implied. So, where is it? We're looking... Maybe it involves this fox. Kind of the entire first area, so. Oh, wait a minute. I just had an idea. Is it possible that you unlock the outfits when you? Uh, see everything on the level. I did collect all of the, like, sites for Cozy Canyon. And, and then I got back and it gave me an outfit. I am grasping at straws here. You know what? I don't... I have no idea. I'm gonna go back to space. I'm going back to the moon. If only because it might have a, uh, a golden gear. Oh look, it's doing that weird debug thing again. That's so strange that it does that when I'm here. That cannot be intentional. Oh, I was right. I have no idea. I'm going back to space. <laughs> I'm full memory. Yeah, pretty much. I don't really know what I'm, what I'm doing here. I I expected there to be a golden gear here. Like this felt like a place where there would be one for sure. I knew it. <laughs> there is one here. Okay, that's probably the only one. So I guess we're going we're going back. Yeah. <laughs> 
And there was. Let's go. Yes. It's like a golden breeze. Interesting. Oh, there's four up here in the sky. There's four more. I guess we're gonna fly around a, a little bit. Where could they possibly be? Like, there's not that many places you could put, put them out here. I mean, obviously there's gonna be one up here. There has to be. There does not have to be, I'm wrong. There's one down there, okay. Woo! Yahoo! Oh my gosh, just get it going through that little opening is gonna be kinda hard. Because this does not turn well. Come on. Okay, we got it. Whoa. There are three more of them in the sky. How much money do I have? 47. Let's go talk to uh let's go talk to her. We have quite a few. Oh, they're just collecting up here. <laughs> you brought me five golden gears. Great job, kiddo. Finish more repairs. Here's a little something. I think it's a medallion. I brought you ten more repairs. <laughs> it's very funny doing this one after another, <laughs> just seeing the animation every time. Okay, that's 15. Oh, oh my gosh, there's 50? There are 50 golden gears. How many... Oh, I guess I can see how many there are. I have not been to... Sinking Sands or Snowland. There are a ton more medallions for Golden Gears. There's obviously two entire minigame collections I have not done yet. I'm not sure about the locations and fossils thing. The fossils part makes sense. Because when you collect enough fossils, the guy gives you, the archaeologist gives you a medallion. I'm not sure about locations. Maybe there is somebody who's tracking that. Oh, there is. It's the map guy. It's, it's the, it's the old man with the rocket. I should go talk to him.
Uh, I believe it counted that gear for the secret. I mean, I'm gonna guess. Where is he? There he is. I'm not. Ch I'm not sure if I'm going to 100% this game. Thanks for marking all the locations in Cozy Canyon. Finish that chapter in my book. And... There it is. Yeah, this game is... Uh, a very... Very like serious collectathon. Do I have enough to buy the thing? No, not even close. And how many did I need to get to the snow area? It was like a lot. 40. And I have 31. You know what? Let's go look at the sand level. I really like how it un... <laughs> <laughs> it, like, unfogs the area to be, like, you know, now you can see what it is, but it, it actually does nothing. Bell Tower Climb. Okay. Okay. Oh, they're little cacti. Welcome to Sinking Sands, hon. Please enjoy your stay and stay out of the quicksand. The, the one lady. Oh. Looking for a mechanic to help fix this old train. Oh. I don't have all the tools. Okay, she needs tools. I'm a mechanic, let me at him. Like, you are a striker, or...? This guy's got a cowboy hat. Oh, he has an extra health. Danger, beware of sinking platforms. Okay, fair enough. You know what? I wonder if I can just triple jump up there and skip whatever it is. One, two, three. Yep. There were spikes up there. There are still spikes up there. I'll climb it. Did that not... Did that not count? It said to climb the bell tower. I climbed the bell tower. Did I have to talk to somebody to, like, trigger the... I, I would expect to ring it. I cannot ring it. Wee! 
Ah, uh, I'm confused. Hup. There's someone in there? There is a cactus down there. Okay. Let me guess. I have to talk to you. Ah. Wash it off. Hup. Okay, this is... This is terrible with the camera. This is really bad. <laughs> Obviously, I need to get to that thing and turn it. There was a medallion in it. Throw a rock at me. What the? I started climbing the other direction. Yes. Yeah, I was jumping on it and nothing. Another island drifted by. Why don't I go check it out? Oh, it's like actually there. Whoa. Is this supposed to be somewhere from the snow area? But I haven't like unlocked the snow area yet. Chirp, chirp, help, help. My six babies are lost. Help me find them. Or pin birds only? Seems a bit rude, but okay. This way to Snowland. Enter the warp. This way to Snowland. Or it sure is cold out here. Hmm. I guess we're gonna take the warp. What does this say? Caution slippery. Oh, so it is. Gondola glide. Gosh, it's right there. No way. You game. That was not it. That was not the, the, the thing. What another strange way of entering a level. Like, we didn't... We didn't... We didn't fly into that. Under the snow tree. Are they two separate zones? They are. They are two separate zones. Including another one that's just flying. Getting up. Here. You're not gonna get away from me. There's another one. Oh, it's going that way? I think that those flying medallions actually are running away from you. Because that started going the other direction. There's now a little desert area. Yahoo! 
and a gear. Well, I'm figuring out where the gears were I couldn't find. This way to mysterious maze. Oh boy. <laughs> that one had an animation? <laughs> where, sheesh, where did all this dust come from? Well, it's a good thing we, us cacti are mostly made of water. Stay safe out there. Hey, hon. This is my maze of mystery. I put something shiny at the end just for you. If you can find your way out, find your way there. It's all yours. Oh, it's a mini game. How does this work? Uh. was behind it. It's so funny that I lift up for this one. Alright, time for medium. What do you mean I can go either way? Uh-huh. Wait. You can go this way, too. I found it. Yes! Did I find that by pure chance? Alright, time for hard mode. Uh oh. I guess that was the game's way of telling me that was the dead end. Okay. Yes, it's not that way. I... I'm sorry. I'm... I'm confused. We're running in a straight line. It's, it's just here. <laughs> I, I don't understand how that works. That one really confused me. I'm, I'm not gonna lie. the snow tree. Okay, we're back here again. I can get up there. I don't know how I did it the first time, but I'm gonna do it. Or I can just wall jump. I mean, it's gotta be this... The, the medallion that's just sitting here, right? Awesome. Okay, that was it. One hundred hidden coins. Great. I now have a head-shaped hole in my wall. 
Oh no. Not the wall. Oh. You caught me. I guess she did say that she had her babies missing. Does this just go on forever? Oh my gosh, I have to catch up to them. You caught me. Okay, that's two. Oh, wait, I have to collect the coins, right? That almost hit me. That could have been bad. Oh right, I needed to I need to defeat them because they have money. There's gotta be another penguin out here. Yes, the other three are probably in the other snow area. Yeah, that would make sense. Alright, I guess we gotta go up now for the rest of the money. This game would be so much better if I just had, like, a, some type of attack option that wasn't jumping. Like, swinging my bag, or a punch, a kick, some type of melee attack. That would really help. That was not money. Still don't know what that does. There's a gear over here. Okay. There we go. Alright, and we got a hundred. Yes, I will buy that. Continue. That was not what I wanted to do. That's got to be all of the everything in this particular warp. Yep. Okay. Oh, right. I still have to do the gondola. Am I supposed to get into this thing? I'm, I'm really not sure. Well, I need to find the baby ping. Whoops. May as well collect the money and the baby penguins while I'm at it. There's one right there. Up. 
Okay, that's five. There should be one. I almost just got hit. I guess I'm up here now. You know what? That's fine. I'm gonna be really disappointed if there's actually not a collect uh, 100 coin challenge for this section. And I'm just like wasting my time. Also, uh, there's an outfit right just sitting there. The blue costume. Oh, the lag? That was, that was crazy. And we fell. Okay. All the babies have been rescued. Okay, there is a... There is a buy 100. Or collect 100 coin challenge. Platforming on ice is not fun. That's a hundred. Yes, I would like to buy this. Imagine all I have to do now is get on one of these gondolas. Which might actually be kind of hard. Oh, that would have been a perfect spot to get on. I don't want to accidentally grab that. Oh, okay. Now we just have to ride it up. Speaking of up and 3D platformers, I see everybody's been playing uh, only up recently. I'm not sure if that's a me game, but I have seen so many people playing that recently. Take a look over there. I think I must have lost the rest of them in Crystal Cavern. The most dangerous. Well, let's go talk to the, the penguin. Or a pin bird. You found them, Chirp. I found shiny object. You take it. And that shiny object? A medallion. All the pin burns have been saved. Um, you know what? Let's go. Let's go take a look at the crystal level because it sounds like that's the last one. I think. Yes, it is.
There we go. Let's see what the last world looks like. Turn on the lights. Oh my gosh, it's a dark area. Gosh, this is giving huge vibes of uh, one of the sections in Mario 64 that I cannot remember the name of. It is where you get... You, you use the metal hat there. This power outage has seriously slowed down our operations. Those blasted green ghoulies. Three switches. Makes sense. Okay, that's another one. You can get away with some really crazy platforming, like the skip stuff in this game. <laughs> I have realized. Hey, the lights are on. I'm so happy that that fell down. I thought I was going to have to climb all the way up. Alright, I guess I'm still going to have to do some climbing. We have been everywhere. We've been everywhere at least once. And we've collected quite a few gears. What is that? What is that thing? Oh, we can't turn it anymore, though. That area in the back really looks like a final... No, that's the sand area. Never mind, I'm wrong. Does this game have an end? <laughs> like... How do, you, how do you win at this game? Is it really collecting everything? Usually games like this have, like, a you can beat the game, and then if you collect everything, there's a little bit extra. I'm starting to think this is a you-don't-win-until-you've-done-it-all kind of game. You know what? I think we're going to wrap it up for the day. Since I'm kind of sick with Sinus problem, allergy problem, cold, I'm not really sure what. I think we're going to wrap up for the day here. Now, as for, will I be playing this game again tomorrow as planned? 
I'm not sure. We might uh, we might change it up. But it was fun enough. I did. It was entertaining. Uh, I don't think this game entertained me for the way in the ways it would have wanted. Oops. But it was entertaining, and I'm happy I got to play it with you all because it made it very funny. Let's swap over. There we go. But yeah, thank you so much, everybody, for coming by today. I'm happy you all were here uh, and kept me company while playing that. That you, you all made that game go from kind of mid to entertaining and fun. So thank you. I will see you all again tomorrow. And we will maybe play more, but we might also play something different. I'm not sure yet. But yeah, you all have a great rest of your day. And thank you so much. I'll see you later. Have a good one.